What's up YouTube, it's your boy Stromer back with another video and today we're going to be talking about the Prime 1 Studios Arkham City Harley Quinn. This was shown at the Phase 1 Prime 1 Showcase and I must say that I was blown away but we're going to take a closer look at her today and really see if she's a hit or a miss. So let's jump into it. So I'm going to just go ahead and be upfront with y'all. This is the best Harley Quinn that I've seen in my life. Um, this is my favorite. Um, you know, art is subjective, so I know a lot of people are going to disagree with me, but whatever. Uh, this piece is freaking phenomenal. Love how she's sitting on the chair. If you look at her just sitting in this chair, I love her posture. It is so Harley Quinn, just so unconventional. If you look at her hand, starting off at her hand, if you look at that, you'll see that she's like pressing down into the chair, which I think is just super cool. Um, beside her, I mean, her, well, first let's get into her outfit. Her outfit looks freaking phenomenal. Uh, you know, the colors, the paint apps, it looks so dirty, grimy. It looks so Arkham. I don't know how to explain it. It looks very Arkham. And uh, I mean, if you look around her, she has her bat um, on her right arm, which is super cool. Right next to her bat, there's cigarettes. There's a, like a cigarette tray, like that just looks, that's phenomenal. Like who does that? No, Like no one's ever done that before. It's just so mature. And then up under her, I mean, you have the Jack Daniels that's been spilled over. And that just, that, I love Jack Daniels, by the way. Like, that looks great. Um, and then obviously you have uh, the Joker um, doll there in the front as well. Now, getting into the base, uh, I think that the base was very uh, different, unconventional with the circular base. Uh, I think that Prime 1 tried to do the, you know, they tried to make their base Prime 1 esque, if that makes sense. But. Um, it didn't really work out for this, and it, I mean, I, I'm glad that they did a circular like this. I love the Harley Quinn logo in the front with the die. I think that that looks cool. And also, too, for what it's worth, I really love how now we're getting these Harley Quinn bus displays. Um, I really appreciate that. Like, you know, obviously, you know, when we get these other statues, we get these statues in and we get multiple head swap outs. You know, where do we put them? We have to place them in a, a random box. We have to put them back in the box or... You know it has to just kind of sit next to the the statue but i love how they're giving us these statues um hold you know these these head sculpt holders to kind of put next to the statue and it makes it look very neat and very uh very clean but again like i said i really love this this uh statue here they've done such a phenomenal job with this the chair that she's sitting in looks like it's leather uh i mean they just did a, such a great job they give you three different head sculpts one regular where she's winking which i really like then also there's a second one that I think is really dope as well. Then there's a, there's another deluxe where she's she's doing a wink, but her mouth is closed. Um, and that one's like my least favorite, but I still, I don't think it's bad. Um, if I were to display it, I would probably do it with the regular head sculpt or the deluxe head sculpt. Now, if you order from Prime One directly, you get the gesture head, which I don't think is a must. You already get three head sculpts here, um, but you know, you get a fourth one with them, which you know, I think is might be a bit much uh, for different head sculpts. But I mean, for the price, I mean, I, you know, I need all I can get for this price. Now, speaking of price, let's get into it. This thing is uh, $1,350, man. It's pretty expensive. Is it worth, you know, 13 almost $1,400 I think so I mean if you're a Harley Quinn fan I would pay this price for this uh for this statue I mean it's just that phenomenal to me I think it's perfect like I said this is my favorite Harley so if I was a Batman statue collector I 100% get this this will be shipping uh April 2022 to October 22 so that's a huge gap um we're quite a ways out which is a good thing because if you're ordering here through Sideshow um you know it makes your payments that much more bearable you know as you're paying so you know i really like how they uh, have it have it spaced out here and i mean by the by the way your payments don't start until 2022 so um, you put you pay your non-refundable deposit today and then and you'll start your payments uh in 2022 of february so uh, I, re I highly recommend that you guys go ahead and grab this because i mean why not um it's, you know is that good of a piece and if you are going to grab this piece use the link below in the description it helps the channel whenever you use that link so if you're going to get this just use the link um you know it does help now one last thing before we get out of here all right so final impressions this piece great awesome go ahead and grab it again uh let me know your thoughts in the comments do you like this piece do you not like it are you gonna get it are you not gonna get it love to hear what you guys think but until next time y'all be good y'all be safe and i'll see you in the next video peace